From Emma Roberts getting arrested for hitting her boyfriend to Shia LaBeouf scratching a man's face at an art installation, here are actors who got arrested for shocking reasons. Let's kick things off with Jonathan Major's recent arrest. Now this arrest has taken the industry by storm. Everyone knows that Major was an actor on the rise in Hollywood and the man had some pretty big gigs lined up. That is, until he got arrested for assaulting a woman last month. Let me tell you guys what went down. According to the report, Jonathan and a woman got into a domestic dispute, during which Major struck the victim across her face with an open hand and put his hands on her neck. This left the woman with minor bruises. Luckily, she escaped after making a 911 call, and following that, the actor was arrested by the police and the woman was taken to a hospital. After an investigation, Majors was then charged with several assault and harassment misdemeanors. Eventually, he was released without bail from police custody after a few hours. Now, it didn't take long for Jonathan's team to hit back against the allegations. The actor's lawyer, Priya Chaudhary, in her statement claimed that Majors was innocent and that there was enough proof of it as well. Well, we'll have to wait and see if that's true or not. The actor is expected to appear in court on May 8th. Still, Jonathan isn't the only actor who's been arrested for domestic violence. For instance, Emma Roberts was arrested for the same reason. Yeah, I was shocked to learn about this too, guys. But as it turns out, the sweetheart actress was arrested for hitting her boyfriend Evan Peters back in 2013. Remember him? He and Roberts dated from 2012 to 2019, and oh boy, did they make some headlines. Mostly about this incident. Now, the couple were in Canada when the incident took place. Emma and Evan were overheard by staff and the guests fighting in their room. And things clearly got out of control because someone in their hotel decided to call the police. When the police officers arrived, they immediately arrested Roberts after seeing Evan with a bloody nose and a bite mark. That's pretty disturbing. Disturbing. Sources close to Emma then denied the bite and claimed that both of them were hitting each other, but the actress was arrested only because Peters had obvious injuries. Evan refused to press charges on his girlfriend, and the actress was released shortly from custody too. At this point, I'm just wondering why she wasn't cancelled over this. Plus, do you guys remember those pictures of Roberts crying into Peter's arms that went viral? Yeah, that happened a week after she was arrested. On top of all that, Peters even proposed to her just a few months after this incident. I, I mean, yeah. I mean, she was hilarious, and we just we laughed a lot and had a great time. Yeah, just a strange turn of events, guys. Honestly, she was an actress I wasn't expecting would ever get into trouble with the law. But speaking of trouble, it only makes sense to talk about Shia LaBeouf and his long history of getting arrested. Now, Shia's had multiple run-ins with the law during his career. 11 times, to be exact. I mean, the guy has been getting into trouble since he was nine years old. Back then, he'd just steal a pair of Nikes or a Game Boy. But now, things have gotten much more concerning. In 2014, Shia had a very public drunken meltdown while he was watching the Broadway musical Cabaret. Cabaret? Pff, yeah, Cabaret! <laughs> Cabaret is exactly what I'm gonna do, cabaret. Apparently, LaBeouf was smoking cigarettes inside the theater and yelling curses. During intermission, the police arrested him and he was taken to a nearby police station. Shia was clearly upset by that and decided to spit on one of the officers. I mean, that's just asking for trouble. He then entered into rehab as part of his plea deal, but clearly he didn't learn from his mistakes. Because in 2017, he was once again been arrested for assault after he grabbed a man's scarf and scratched his face. Thankfully for the Terminator star, the charges were later dropped. But that's not all. In that same year, Shia was taken into custody for public drunkenness and disorderly conduct after a stranger refused to give him a cigarette. Then, for a few years, it seemed like the actor's troubled days were behind him. That is, until 2020, when Shia ended up getting into an argument with a man and it got physical. 
Hall. He then snatched the man's hat and ran away with it. Yeah, I have no idea what he was trying to do there. The actor was arrested and charged with petty theft. Still, if you folks thought Shia got into too much trouble, well, Ezra Miller is out to beat his record. Just like LaBeouf, Ezra has an endless rap sheet. In 2020, a video appeared of Miller choking a woman and throwing her on the ground at a bar in Iceland. That got them some headlines, but people had no idea what was about to happen. While they were in Hawaii, Ezra was arrested for allegedly obstructing a highway and refusing to cooperate with police. But that's not the end of it. Just some time later, they were arrested again, but this time for disorderly conduct at a Honolulu karaoke bar. Allegedly, Miller yelled curses and became angry with the people who were singing. Then a couple filed a restraining order against them and claimed that the star of The Flash burst into the couple's bedroom. Threatening to kill them, he even stole a wallet among other things. That would just scare me for life, honestly. What's more is that just days after the premiere of Fantastic Beasts The Secrets of Dumbledore, Miller was arrested for suspicion of second degree assault in Hawaii. After they threw a chair that struck a woman in the head and caused their injuries. Talk about taking your role seriously. Plus, what is with all these actors just hitting people all the time? Anyways, after wreaking havoc everywhere for two years, they decided to apologize for everything, which is the least they could do, right? But it's not just Miller who surprised the world with his antics. Let's talk about an actor that you might not expect to find on a list like this. I'm talking about Tiffany Haddish driving under the influence. Yep, this actually happened. In 2022, Haddish was arrested in Georgia after police responded to a 911 call. It turns out that Tiffany had fallen asleep at the wheel on a highway. The law enforcement believed that she'd smoked and was clearly not in the right state of mind to drive around. Tiffany was then released from jail after a few hours, but the actress wasn't concerned about the whole thing at all. I mean, she was even smiling in her mugshot. Tiffany then later joked about how she was praying to God for a new man and God sent her four men in uniform. I mean, only Tiffany can make a joke out of such a scary situation. Well, let's wrap up this video by talking about Drake Bell's shocking arrest in 2017. The child star was charged with attempted child endangerment, among other charges, related to juveniles. According to the police report, the victim was an underage girl who met him online and attended one of his concerts. The two then engaged on multiple occasions. In 2018, the victim reported Drake to the police. Bell initially pleaded not guilty to the charges, but later changed his plea to guilty and expressed how he now knew that his conduct had been wrong. Bell was sentenced to two years probation and 200 hours of community service. Well, there you have it. Those were actors who got arrested for shocking reasons.